Donald, nice to meet you. My name's Laura, I'm a physio. I understand you've been having some problems with your elbow. Mm -hmm. Would it be okay if we took a look at it today? Sure, sounds good. Okay, so first of all, if we just have a little look at your elbow, just have a see if there's any swelling um, or any deformity, but it's looking good, okay? So first of all, if you could just show me the movements, bringing your arms, both of them all the way up, just bend them as far as you can. Does that give you any problems? Yeah. So just with this one here, if I can take it all the way in with a little bit more pressure. How's that? It's okay. Good, okay, relax your arms down. And now if you can just straighten your arms completely, lock those elbows out. Good, again, are you comfortable with that? Mm -hmm. And if I just put some pressure, how's that? It's okay. Great, okay. And now this time we're just gonna have a little look at you turning your hand over. Good. And then bringing your palm all the way back up again. How does that feel? Sure. All right. So let's have a little look at how strong you are in those movements now. So if you could just pull your hand up towards you. That's great. And then just push down into my hand. Lovely. Okay. And now in this position, we're just going to see how strong you are in that turning movement. Okay. So again, just push into me there. Good. Lovely. And then if you just... Gonna, this time you're going to turn that way, okay? And again, push. Lovely. And then relax there. Good. So no problems with those movements. So if we have a little look now, I'm just going to put some pressure here around this little bony point here and into some of the muscle. Does that give you any problems? Uh, no. Okay. And then this time to the inside of the elbow. How does that feel? Fine. And again, no problems just into where that muscle attaches? No. Okay. So this time with your arm out straight, you're going to bend that wrist down. And if I just stretch you out here, again, is that giving you any problems into mm. here? All right. This time if you just push that middle finger into my hand, just stretching up. And again, is that giving you any problems mm. there? All right. And then this time with your whole wrist, you're going to move up in that direction. Okay. And again, push and relax. How does that feel? Okay, so we're going to repeat now with your arm up, bend the wrist down, and then that little middle finger coming all the way up. Good, and relax. Again, any problems into this side? And then with the whole wrist, that upwards movement. Good, and then relax there. And again, was that giving you anything no. through there? Lovely, okay. Just relax all the way down. Just going to have a little feel around the bony part of your elbow here. First of all, just into that little groove where your nerve can sit. Is that giving you any problems? No. Good. And then the same on the inside there. That's Good. Fine. Okay. And then if you just relax your elbow there, keep your shoulder relaxed. And if I just come in across here and just put some pressure over there, how does that feel? That feels fine. Good. Okay. And relax your hand down there. So we assessed um, Donald's elbow today. We looked at his active range of movement, his strength through flexion, extension, pronation and supination. We also um, assessed his lateral and medial epicondyles for tenderness and then for resisted movements at the wrist and the fingers to see whether this provoked any of his symptoms um, at the lateral and medial epicondyles. Um, you can also have a look at the integrity of the medial and lateral structures and again at the um, olecranon and around the olecranon fossa to see if any tenderness or any deformities.